Hi guys, hi. <laughs> and welcome to another video. My name is Rachel Rice, if you're new to my channel. So today is Monday. I'm currently getting ready to go to my 8 a.m. class, which I want to skip so bad <laughs> because I'm so tired and so sleepy. I think Mondays are my worst days. They're just so busy. Well, I think it's probably because I have like two labs and one of them is a two hour lab-ish, I think. And the other one is a three hour lab. So just imagine, plus my other classes, it's crazy. But anyways, I'm gonna go and take a shower real quick and yeah, hurry up and leave the place to get to school on time, so yeah. <laughs> I'm done with my class and my lab today. I'm going to my third class. Then after that class, I have five minutes and my three hour lab is following right after. Sadly, I forgot my lab got at home. I wasn't really rushing to get out of the house, but I think I just forgot it. But anyways, I texted my brother, actually I called my brother, that if he's going to school, he should take my lab good with him. So he said, okay, I'm just hoping he does take it with him to school because if not i'm pretty screwed i really can like go home to go get it and go back to school if i do that i'm gonna make my next class that class is like mandatory attendance yeah i'm just hoping that he has my lab coat and my goggles with him one time i needed my wallet right so i called him to get my wallet for me so he has to like get my wallet and drive to where am i and bring it to me on the way to where I'm at, like he was like almost close. I caught him and I'm like, where are you at? He was like, oh, I'm almost there. Five seconds later, he calls me back and says, oops, I forgot the wallet at home. So I'm just hoping that this situation doesn't happen again where I'll call him and he's like, oops, I forgot your coat at home because that would be so messed up. But, um, yeah. Anyways, it's 11.15 and I'm gonna go. Yeah. <laughs> My tire, oh my god, it wasn't drying. I was so pissed. I have to wait the longest thing. You know what happened? Like, what? Like, when I was trying to put it in a vial, for uh -huh. some reason, I was expecting it to be like a lot like last week. Uh -huh. It was a lot shorter. Oh, yeah, mine too. I was like,
guys, happy Tuesday. So today, I'm taking my first exam of this semester. It's midterm, like first midterm week. And I'm taking my first exam today at 10 o'clock. There is one part of the material that I'm not familiar with it. I was supposed to memorize the 20 amino acid, but I did memorize all of them. Well, more like I can recognize it, but I cannot recall it, which is two different things, right? But so far, I'm just excited for the test. I just want to see what's on it, how it is, and how it's going to go. This is our first exam. We're going to have the exam and the final. So yeah, also, also, I have another exam tomorrow. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I think my professor just will not take me out with this exam and a bunch of homeworks too, like, it's crazy. But anyways, I'm gonna go shower and I'm gonna get ready and leave. I have work after my class, so, yeah. I'm commuting to school and sometimes, you don't know, there might be crazy traffic, there might not be crazy traffic. So it's better to be there on time. Plus, I think there is like 90, 90 plus people in that class. And I want to go and have a good seat. done with my exam there's one question on there that i totally got zero over nine because it was a math problem i didn't know how to do it it's like i had the concept but it wasn't concepted <laughs> but i'm hoping that i at least get one point but i'm just going with zero because i think that's what i'm gonna get but so far it wasn't really bad i should have said more and now I know my mistakes and stuff like that. So our next exam, I'm gonna study really, really hard. But yeah, right now I'm going to the clinic and I'm just eating some bread on my way there. So I have another exam like I said yesterday and it's at 8 a.m. My plan today was to wake up at 4 also wake up at 4 a.m. and study before I have to go take my exam since it was at 8 a.m. Basically I will study for like two hours ish before I have to go to class, right? But I overslept. My alarm did ring by turning it off. And I was like, you know, I'm sleeping a little bit more <laughs> and now it's 6 o'clock Which is crazy because I have to leave the house at 7 o'clock, like 7.20 So I pretty much have one hour to review the material before I have to go to class and take the, um, take the test I'm currently reading the last topic that we covered in class Which is endocrine system, let me see endocrine system yeah so that is the topic that i'm um, reviewing before i have to go to class <music> It's currently 8.40, but majority of the student got done at 8.30, and it's a multiple choice question, so keep that in mind, so it kind of makes sense for them to get done that early. And there's also like one thing that I do after an exam, is that I don't really go back to check my note to make sure that I got the right answer or I got the wrong answer. I feel like when you go look at your notes and you realize that you got a question right or a question wrong, what do you get out of that? 
if you go and check your note right and you realize that you got a question wrong are you gonna go back and do it again no <laughs> and if you get a question right i guess you'll feel good about yourself but i feel like both then or just doing that it's not necessary for me when i'm done with an exam i'm done i'm moving on to the next exam on the next then you know there's no need to be drooling on a past thing anyways i since the exam got done really early i have a lot like have a longer break before my next class so i'm going to start on my homeworks that are due tonight and my upcoming homework too so yeah that is the plan and yeah on my homework the last question i did like eight attempt and i still don't get it and i think it's frustrating me but good thing is the our professor extended the due date from today to next week Wednesday, which is like, yay. Sometimes I do not know if I should wash my face, then shower, or do the opposite. Oh, and talking about shower. <laughs> I actually did take a shower this morning when I was going to school. <laughs> uh, I mean, I can use that time to review instead of taking a shower because I had an exam. I'm pretty much done for today so thank you for watching this video and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't see you guys in my next video bye